トータルフィードバックをご覧の皆さん、こんにちは。死んだ僕の彼女でギターを弾いている木下と申します。それから、えー、先ほど公演に入り、えー、ライブを終えたアストロブライト主催者のスコット・コルツさんです。今日はあのインタビューをさせていただくということで、いろいろお話聞かせていただきたいと思いますので、どうぞよろしくお願いします。So, uh, I will start with the interview. It's, uh, and so you just finished your show today. today. Yeah. And how, uh, how was your show tonight? I think it was pretty good. Pretty good? Yeah, I was happy with it. Yeah, I thought yeah, so too. Yeah, I especially liked all the bands、mm-hmm. that I played before.、Uh-huh. So really、good.、Uh-huh. Very good.、Uh-huh. Okay. So I will ask you several questions. The first, first question is、uh, What did you eat for your breakfast today?、Um, <laughs> do you remember? Yeah. What are they? The little triangles? The little triangles. Oh, wait. Crunchy? Was that just cereal? No. Crunchy salmon? Tuna? Ah, I see. Right there. So, see, see in the hotel? No, no. At a family、ah, mart? I see. The rice bowl. Rice bowl. <laughs> that's, rice what I, that's what I eat. That's what I eat every day. Hi. That's all right. I want to record this. They're called rice bowl? Rice bowl, yeah. With、uh, seaweed around it. Those are good. Oishi.、Uh-huh. Oishi. Oishi. <laughs> And do you have any、uh, plans of visiting、uh, places in Japan for sightseeing on this trip?、Uh, the Toy Museum, Ghibli Museum. Toy Museum.、Uh-huh. And Ghibli in Mitaka. Oh, yeah. Ghibli is in Ghibli is in Mitaka. The Kichi George. Ghibli Museum. Uh-huh. Have you been to the museum? Ahihabara. Ahihabara. Yeah. I'm going to go there. New vintage clothing stores,、uh-huh. record stores, mm, mm, mm. Yes, yes. maybe music store,、yes. music instruments. Have you been to Ochanomizu? No, Ochanomizu is famous for record stores too. And、oh, also,、okay. pedals.、Oh, Many pedals. Really? Where's、yeah. that at? I want to go there. Yeah, it's close to Akihabara.、Uh, so、next next、oh. station. Okay.、Yeah. All right. <laughs> go there. So, I believe the last time you came to Tokyo was、uh, 2015. Yes. Do you feel any changes between the time you came here and now? The changes, the changes in the overall the life or music? Oh, or? I, yeah, I feel like we were stronger tonight. Stronger, uh huh. Yeah, I had, I had fun the last time I came.、Mm-hmm. Um, it, was a really good, it was a really good trip.、Uh-huh. But I feel like. The performance that we did tonight, we played more songs. Mm, mm, mm. And we also played songs、um, that I've been wanting to perform live for a yeah, long yeah. time. So that was, that was a big difference.、Uh-huh. To go to classic songs. Classic、oh, songs. Yeah. yeah. It's exciting. Yeah, it's very nice. Okay. So,、uh, I, want to, I wanted to ask you about your new gear you、uh, posted on the Facebook. Oh, okay. This is、uh, analog cassette. Oh, yeah. So, you, you got this already?、Uh, it's still being made and it should be s e n t pretty soon. So, it's not here yet? It's not here yet. Ah.、Oh. Yeah, it's almost here. But it's a four track. Four t- so, it's、oh, an old. It's four track. It's a、uh-huh. four track. It's a task game. And he took、task、it apart.、Mm-hmm. So, he took it apart and then he、ah, I see. So、rebuilt it with aluminum. So, it's metal. That's why there's no sign yet. Right. Well, so, he redesigned it. It's an old, yeah. Oh no. So it's analog tape. So that's that. That's how you get the asteroid sound. Yeah. It's because、yeah, yeah. it's real. It's just this is my key. It's a so- Sony cassette recorder. Oh, yeah, that's beautiful. Yeah, yeah I bought it in Hokkaido.、Uh, I was like, do, do you know the Blue Buddy? This is a po- portable cassette player. Oh, yeah. So it turns、yeah. into the music to MP3. <laughs> that's great. So, uh, uh, in terms of cassette tapes, do you, do you use it for your creation or、yes. do you also listen to cassette tapes? I listen to them. You listen、well. to cassette tapes too. I like buying tapes from bands.、Uh-huh. More than CDs. More than CDs.、Huh? Because tapes feel 
I don't know, there's something more tactile and, about yeah, the tape physical and itself. I mean, the CD, all CDs are the same. Uh -huh. But every single tape is mm -hmm. different. Mm -hmm. just, you know, just every single one is just like a print uh -huh. of sound. Uh -huh. But um, I don't know, there's just something about, there's something charming about cassette tapes that I still like. So I buy them when I see them. If bands have a tape, I'll buy their tape. Uh, do, do you make cassette tapes with Astro Boy 2 in the US? Or? Um, I have. I've made a yeah. couple. Yeah, uh -huh. I did Crush and Pink Shiny Ultra mm, Blast, mm, mm. and we're gonna do we're gonna do more. Uh -huh. We're gonna release more tapes. Yeah, I noticed the many uh, United States bands are making CDs and records and also cassette tapes. Yeah, same time. Tapes somehow came back. I don't know how. Mm. But I'm glad that they did. Mm, yes, yes. I, I really like tapes too. So. Yeah, so. I'm trying to find. Um, Right, but there's good technology in Akihabara? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I could find that. a Walkman, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, find yeah. Find an actually good, uh -huh. good Walkman. Okay, so that's and what I want to do. I want to go find a, a nice cassette player, tape player. Did, have you ever heard about a store called Hard Off? Hard Off is like a recycle shop. Oh. And in a suburb of uh, countryside of Japan, there are many cassette players in Hard Off. Oh, wow. So it's kind of a uh, treasure hunting for me. Oh yeah, I would love to, yeah, I'd love to get my hands on something like yeah. that. So that's why when that guy offered to build that uh -huh. tape machine for mm, me, I was like, so yes, it's new vintage kind of. Exactly. Okay. Okay. So I want to ask you a little bit about the music. Could you tell us uh, anything which influenced your uh, works of uh, Astro Boys, like uh, art or? Painting or music or bands. Anything. An influence aspect. Yeah. Um, let me think. Just music in general. Mm -hmm. Movie soundtracks. Movies. Mm -hmm. Movie uh -huh. soundtracks mm -hmm. are a big influence. Uh huh. Because that's the first kind of music that you really hear when you're a kid. Mm -hmm. You don't really hear people putting on music just watching a movie. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Cartoons. Cartoons. Uh huh. Bugs Bunny music. Mm, mm. Bugs Bunny music. Insane. Ah, that's <laughs> ridiculous. It's insane ah, music. But uh -huh. cartoon music is very sound effect. Mm. So, so mixed yes, with music, yes. so you have uh -huh. noise and music yeah, yeah, mixed yeah. together, uh -huh. and it's just normal. Mm -hmm. So I feel like noise and just finds its way to music mm. pretty easily. Mm. So I think that was a way for me to um, incorporate noise. It's just thinking that that's the a, a way for things to be. Uh -huh. So when I heard Jesus and Mary Chain, uh -huh. Velvet Underground, uh -huh. you know, back in the 80s, mm -hmm. that seemed like, oh, of course, this is the way to do it. Mm -hmm. This is how it should be done. Mm -hmm. So, you know, my, my buddy Valentine is still alive uh -huh. and all the big shoe music bands, that's what it's like they're doing, they're taking the music and, uh -huh. and noise mm -hmm. and just smashing them together. Yeah. And it seems right. Mm -hmm. It didn't seem mm -hmm. abnormal at all or weird. Uh -huh. It's like, of course, uh -huh. that should have been a thing to do. Um, John Cage. John Cage, yes. Um, his, his books that he mm -hmm. wrote about sound, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that was a big influence. Mm -hmm. Brian Eno's ambient music. Mm -hmm. I heard Brian Eno's ambient music before I heard mm -hmm. his pop music. Mm -hmm. But his ideas about sound were very influential. Mm -hmm. Do you also tell us about uh, a local band or artist, you, your favorite local band? Mm -hmm. Local band? Yeah, I I learned uh, Favre, Favre. Oh yeah, uh, Sophie, Sophie. Yeah, Sophie's band. Yeah, and also Radio Shack. Radio band. Shack, Kelly. Radio yeah, Shack. so Sophie's. And also the Sleepwalk. The oh band. right, yeah, Brains. Yeah, yeah. Sleepwalk is really good. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And it's fun, kind of funny that Nar Narasaki and yeah, Narasaki Narasaki is also Sleepwalk. It's. Is it? I thought it was just Watchmen. It's it's Narasaki's in there. It's Narasaki and yeah. Okay. Okay. Right. okay, good. Yeah, Sleepwalk. Narasaki and Watchmen. Oh. Sleepwalk is really good. Mm, it's ambient. It's crazy. <laughs> I love it. Uh huh. Yeah, I remember. Uh, yeah, Watchmen had. When I first came here in 2000, I got a Watchman CD. Mm. It was just Lot of the wildest. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All over the place. Uh huh. So he's so good. He's, they're both so good. Yeah, every she They're the most talented, yeah. On tonight's show. Yeah, I miss them. And any other local bands? I'm trying to think of a local band that I really like. There's so many. I'm just uh -huh. trying to think of which one mm -hmm. that really sticks out. 
Canyons. My friend's band New Canyons is really good. New Canyons. I'm trying to think of mm-hmm. what else. Um, Matches is really Hedges. good. Drawing a blank. There's so many people. Mm-hmm. Dude, so much stuff. Juna is, a, is another band that I can think of. Mm-hmm. Juna. Just because she's amazing. It's like one woman and a, and a, and a man, a duo, and she's playing guitar and playing uh-huh. keyboard with her feet. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. At the same time, she's playing bass uh-huh. with her feet and playing guitar and singing, and then her drummer. Oh. That's, they're pretty amazing, so. Okay. And also your local uh, favorite local venue in Chicago. I think it's the Metro, just because of all the shows. Metro. The Metro. Just because of how many shows they have of people that I want to see. But also Thalia Hall is also pretty good. Mm-hmm. That Thalia. Yeah, Thalia. Thalia. Hall. But yeah, I would say the Metro. Mm-hmm. The Metro is my favorite. Yeah, I hope someday I could visit Chicago and see the oh, show yeah, in Chicago. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Thank you. So, uh, so uh, another question is: So I think uh, Astrobyte fans are super cool because uh, they have a certain kind of sensor to uh, catch the beauty inside your music. And your, yeah, Astrobyte's music. Mm-hmm. And what kind of uh, feelings do you have towards Astrobyte fans? What kind of feelings do I have yeah. towards Astrobyte fans? Um, graciousness. Graciousness, graciousness. Yes. Oh, thank you wow. for. Uh huh. Because when I'm making the albums, I'm just making them for myself to mm-hmm. listen to. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, the new album that I was trying to get finished uh-huh. before I came here, mm-hmm. I've been listening to it for about two years now. Uh huh. Just trying to make it better. Mm-hmm. So I live with the songs for a long time before I ever, ever release them. Mm-hmm. Crush. Pink Shiny, Uncle Glass, all of these albums were just like my own personal collection and then I just decided mm-hmm. like, okay, I guess I should release it. But I I just do it for myself and I'm just, like I guess I'm gracious and mm-hmm. appreciative that mm-hmm. the fans like something that I I like yeah, just for myself. I'm sure your fans are waiting for you in your album. I hope so. And today's uh, Encore, Encore was a heart movie moment. Uh, yeah. Well, it was... Uh, the song Happy Sad from mm-hmm. Crush mm-hmm. that I just I've never performed live before, so oh. I was just trying to remember how oh. it was. Like it was a rare moment. Yeah. So oh. I had I, I knew it was something that I could I could do at that moment. I'm happy I could watch it. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. It's, yeah it's spur of the moment. So this is the last question. Okay. <laughs> So can you ch- uh, could you share with us your future plans of Astrobrite? Do you have any? Uh, yeah, just finishing up uh, the new albums. Mm-hmm. Um, what set Astrobrite back the past few years was a friend of mine who is my sound mastering guy. Mm-hmm. He passed away, oh. so I wasn't able. I really didn't try to do any to do anything mm-hmm. after that. So that was. Right after we came to do uh, 2015, so mm-hmm. it was in 2016. Mm-hmm. So that's what set us back. Mm-hmm. But now um, I'm ready to start releasing uh, more music. So I have mm-hmm. a bunch of Ash Red albums mm-hmm. that are just ready to go. Mm-hmm. So I think we're gonna have a, a lot more music coming. Yeah, yeah, and I hope your new cassette cassette player will arrive soon. I hope so too. Yeah, that would be great. Uh-huh. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. ありがとうございます。